2032, baby girl. You hear me? 2032. They smack you today, slam you, stretch you out, and you don't get out. You don't get those cuffs off till 2032. What are you going to do when they give you 10? What are you going to do? They thought they took 10 years from me. All they did was put me light years ahead. Light years ahead. Imagine that. Imagine. Never even touching a body of water. Never. No pool, no back, no ocean. Never even being around a fucking woman. Her smell, her scent, that touch. What are you guys crying about? What is holding you back? What? Really, tell me, what is the real problem? You fucking punk little pussy bitches think you got to get stretched out like your boy to learn some shit? That was 10 years of not having everything I needed, and I still excelled. What do you think you could do out here with 10 years, with all this freedom, with all this opportunity? Your bitch ass just hasn't put in 10 years in anything. The second you put 10 years into anything consistent, unbroken time, you're going to excel past your wildest dreams. But a bitch can't even do 10 months, can't even do 10 weeks. 10 fucking years is unfathomable to a bitch ass pussy out here. The fuck you guys think you're hard for if you can't put in the work? All these gangsters and ballers in thought. Never even done shit. Literally. Wake the fuck up. You don't need anything other than to put your heart wholeheartedly. Pursue that vision that's deep in your chest that resonates with you. Ten fucking years. Ten fucking years. They thought they could break a motherfucker. You think you could bounce back? You think you could? How many of you know that did? How many? At point zero 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 one motherfucker over here. Be that motherfucker. Really? Really? Are you undeniable? Is there areas that you're excelling in so hard that nobody can tell you shit? That's the goal. It's like, you guys want to compete so bad you forgot to prepare. I'm so prepared that I don't got to compete. Do you get the difference? You get it? If we all pull the fuck up and we all step the fuck out, we know who did the work. We know who did the preparation. Always want to denounce external gain like there's something so valuable internally. If you really possessed those internal traits you supposedly have lived under for so long, you'd have the external gain. If you were the rare man, you'd be rich, stupid. If you lived as a rare man, for any true duration of time, that discipline, that character, those virtues, if you really fucking applied them for any duration of time, you'd be rich, stupid. You'd be ripped, stupid. That's why when you see those motherfuckers and they have it across the board, you know that their, their interior matches their exterior. A soft exterior is only, is only proof of a soft interior. I know exactly why you guys can't hack it. It's your fucking vagina gets in the fucking way every time you're supposed to step up for the day and selflessly operate correctly. Do you know what you did when you failed to inspire someone? Do you know what the fuck you did when you failed to inspire someone? You let the world down, motherfucker. Got a message from someone today. I posted some shit. On my Instagram, me getting out the brand new 2022 Maybach with 12 motherfucking miles on it. And it said, either way, they're going to hate. Blew a kiss emoji at you punks. A man on my program, I go to his messages. He said, Wes, this is the first time I got up out of my chair in two years. He was doing a fucking pull up. Hadn't got out of his wheelchair in two years. And then below it, he said, how could they know your story and still hate? Fuck! What the fuck? What are you really fighting? What are you really fighting? What is it? It's you, punk. It's your desires. It's your fucking fraudulence towards that timeline. 
Got a couple years in. Fuck your couple years. Fuck them. Fuck them. Straight up. Fuck your couple years. You think I give a shit about that? You guys watch me run this shit in since the day I got out. And fuck me anyways. Because I did it for everybody else. I was already good. I already knew who the fuck I was. I already validated myself with my fucking actions. As soon as self-transcendence occurred. As soon as I know I had to live for the world. As soon as I knew the feeling of living for this entire fucking world. That's when I was impervious to any defeat. And I did that long ago. Because prison, motherfucker, it's its own little world. Everybody is their own little fucking... Everybody is absorbed in their own little problem. And as soon as you can show them that their own little stupid fucking problem is only big to them and the world is much larger and that what they believe the world owes them, they owe the world, then they could get it. Motherfucking pussy victim bitches think the world owes you shit. The world was here first, punk. How the fuck would it owe you anything? Saw a fucking lame in my comments the other day, some victim ass comment. Some of us, when we got out of prison, we were homeless and we didn't get it. We, 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 we. Motherfucker, you went and stuck that needle in your arm and grabbed the bottle. You went against the first fucking rule that I tell you motherfuckers not to break. Drop the vices, you fucking pussy. Straight up. You know how disrespectful it is to everybody who believes in you when you choose to partake in vices that don't add to the fucking evolution of your consciousness? Every fucking day I've been out here. I've worked in every fucking way to elevate myself. And you fucking kids want to say, maybe I have to just do 10 years if I'm going to be successful. 10 years would break your bitch ass. 10 hours would fuck face. The fuck is this? How delusional are you? Trying to fucking make up fucking stories like, like them cops in prison. If I had all day to work out watching, I'd be jacked too. Fuck your fat ass would be fatter, bitch. Your tits would be floppy or stupid. Fuck you think this is. Your, your environment don't change your heart, bitch. You got heart or you don't, you fucking frauds. I'm gonna fucking continually show up and either compress the fuck out of you motherfuckers or just show you exactly how this shit's done every fucking day. We're all living life. The problems we all have are the biggest problems in the world to us. You could stub your fucking toe today and care more about that than people dying all over the world of starvation and still cry about your fucking perfect diet. Bitches, shit makes me sick. Never Act like you never even fucking lost nothing. This ain't my first fucking rodeo. Watch. Watch as life tries to fucking hand motherfuckers shit and the real ones, they just step the fuck up even harder. Can't break them. Let's go.